Okay, so I haven't done a video for a while, so I just thought I would just do one to encourage you. I want to, I feel like I need to encourage you and say that everything is going to be okay. I mean, I've gone through some internal tumultuous stuff over the last couple of weeks and you know my anxiety levels have been way up here but i've got through and nothing's changed like you know i'm not suddenly a millionaire and the things that i was worrying about haven't actually changed but what i've what has changed is that i make a conscious decision every single day even if I don't fulfill that decision, even if I think that I'm failing at that decision, but I still make a conscious decision every single day to try and feel a little bit better. And so when you at least try and feel better, then the law of attraction picks up on that and it's just like, okay, so she's just trying. And it's like that, that, um, that quote that says, you know, when you take one step towards God, take God takes a leap towards you and that's exactly how it is like and then when you improve your vibration when you start feeling a little bit better then things start manifesting around you that will give you evidence of that improved vibration of that improved feeling that you that you've managed to achieve and you know and I, today i've had like yesterday i made a concerted decision that i was going to recommit to being vegan that i was going to have a really nice lovely relaxed monday and that i was going to feel better because i was sick of feeling how i did last week you know which was just wallowing in worry like literally that's all i was doing and you know, it's a miracle that I actually feel so much better today because last week I couldn't see a way out of it. And I was just like, what is going on? What's wrong with me? You know, do I need to go on antidepressants or, you know, what's what's wrong? Because any because I'm so sensitive now, it's just like any tiny shift in my vibration levels, in my emotion levels really, really, um, you know, it affects me quite profoundly. And that's something that I'm working on and, you know, it's good to be sensitive, but because of the work that I want to do and everything, I need to just be able to manage that a bit better and to be able to flow with change a bit more easily. But it will come, you know, and I'm not perfect and I'm just trying to do my best. I'm just doing, I'm not trying to do my best, I am doing my best. In each moment and that's all you can do you know that's all you can expect of yourself so and so I just wanted to make this video to encourage you because the next few months are going to be epic like not just amazing but I have got a feeling that for anyone that's been really doing work and really focusing on making some changes in their life I've just got a feeling that the next few months are going to be really awesome and that there are going to be, you know, it's, it's harvest time. So all those little seeds, those little projects that you've been setting up and, and planting and nurturing and watering and growing over the, over the last month or you know, since spring or, you know, and, and it's, it's seasonal. So it could be, you know, it could have been years that these projects have been in development and you, you know, for years you've just been sowing these little seeds and setting up all these little projects and it feels like nothing's really happening with them. But I got a feeling that those little projects that didn't seem like anything was happening actually, all of the, because you've just kept moving forward and you've just kept doing, taking little tiny actions, which is all God needs, something amazing is going to happen. And it's going to happen over the next few months. And when, as we, you know, and it's just, it's going to be awesome. I can really feel it. And for me too, like, you know, I've got a lot of projects that, um, not a lot of projects, one core project and other projects that are very important to me. And I've got a feeling that some really awesome stuff is 
is on the way and it's all about collaboration and it's about community and it's about connecting the three c's collect collaboration connecting and community and so whatever that means to you get on it because firstly you don't have to do this all on your own secondly it's more fun when you do it with other people and thirdly there are absolutely i guarantee you people that will have Similar, if not exactly the same idea, but similar beliefs, similar desires, similar things that they want to offer the world and similar things that they want to achieve. And so just get out there and go to events and, and speak to people. Don't go to networking events if you don't like networking. Just go to an event that is you find interesting and then talk to people. You know, smile at someone, go over and ask them, about, you know, like, like, why are you here? What, like, what's your name? You know, like when you were a child and you didn't care what someone thought about you, just go and ask them, hi, what's your name? My name's Shay. You know, I'm here, we're here at the same event. We're clearly interested in the same things. Let's talk. You know, it's not rocket science to just start a conversation with somebody and you never know, like, follow your intuition. If you're not drawn to someone, don't talk to them. But if you're drawn to someone, you better talk to that person because they might have something to offer you or you might have something to offer them. And more than likely, it's going to be a mutual um, conversation and a mutual meeting of minds and connecting. So just go for it. And I really um, just want you to feel encouraged that something amazing is going to happen and that it's only like you have not seen your best days yet.